Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for August 26th of 2025 is titled A Leaky Solar Prominence. So, what do we see here? Well, here what we're going to see is a video clip, or actually a time lapse, that will run for about three seconds. But I've got it on repeat, so it's going to keep going over and over again, so that you can take a look at it while we discuss what is happening here. Now, this is an example of a solar prominence. What happens is that the sun's magnetic field gets all twisted and tangled over the course of its cycle. And when it does that, various magnetic field lines can then pop through the surface. Magnetic fields like this can lift up charged particles, and that's what you're seeing here is those charged particles that have been lifted off the surface. And you can see a part of that material just kind of hovering in the air. Now, you might think that's defying gravity, but really it is not. The magnetic force is much stronger than the gravitational force, and it is very easy for something like this, for a magnetic field, to lift material off away from gravity. Just as a magnet here on Earth can lift a paperclip off the desk against the gravity of the Earth pulling it down, so can the sun's magnetic field lift material off the solar surface and hold it up there for a period of time. And that's kind of what you see. There's nothing supporting that. It's just hanging there in space. Now, it's not going to stay there. And in fact, as you watch the time lapse, you can see how the material is kind of raining back down onto the solar surface. Now, if it is lifted with enough force, it can actually be expelled away from the sun altogether and head out into space. That's what we call a solar flare. But in a weaker situation, it just lifts the material up and then it rains back down onto the surface of the sun. And that's what we're seeing here. So it really depends on the intricacies of the magnetic field and how strong it lifts that material off with how much force it lifts that off. Now, prominences like this are larger than the size of Earth. So, I'll give you an idea of a sense of scale there, Earth could be smaller than this whole prominence that we're seeing. So, it gives you kind of a perspective as to how large things are on the Sun, and the Sun is many times the size and many times the mass of the Earth. Now, the time lapse that we look, as I said, it's three seconds on repeat here as you're looking at it but it actually is about an hour's worth of time in real life. So this took about an hour. We've compressed it down to just a few seconds so that you can really see it's only that little bit that happens within that, in that whole hour. Now, prominences are part of solar activity. The more active the sun is, as it is right now, the more we see things like solar prominences, solar flares, and sunspots. That's when they become much more common on the surface of the sun, and we see far more solar activity in terms of auroral activity here on Earth when material lifted off the sun and is then expel happens to be expelled in the direction of Earth. So that was our picture of the day for August 26th of 2025. It was titled, A Leaky Solar Prominence. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Star Jet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.